All right, here we are. We have an option of going either to the frozen wasteland or the desert. Hey, hey. Welcome, welcome. <clears throat> Karaka Desert or Ice Country. Now, I think the game expects you, even though it does give you the choice, the first one, it probably expected you to go to the desert first. The Ice Country is a little bit more difficult. It's probably intended to be done separate or second. You are filling me with confidence. <laughs> and of course, without the flying through the mode 7 section, the map, it's hard to tell that, well, we didn't really make it. Or how far we went. Before we shrivel up. All right. I don't remember how to escape from the desert. You're more or less just stuck out here until you find your way out. And it was it. Hmm. It was an irritating section. I wouldn't say it was difficult like the ice country is. Hey, sprite leveled up. Ah, oh, those things. Let's just skip over those. Didn't take the da Oh, no, we did take damage. Stop missing. <laughs> oh, these... Oh, what? Come on. One of the irritating concepts of these old games, like, it's kind of bad design nowadays to make a, make an enemy that is capable of hitting you regardless of what you do. Of course, we're capable of doing the exact, op exact same thing to them. Pumpkin heads! So it's sort of like mutually unfair. <laughs> but it's frustrating. And it's honestly something that modern game design doesn't really allow for anymore. Unblockable attacks, it's kind of ridiculous. Eventually, we run into the sand ship. But we keep running into the same environment, so try in different directions. I haven't rent left a bunch of times. There we are. What? There's no door. Oh, that was close. You there? What are you doing out here on this sand ship? Only Imperial spies could be so stupid. Who are you calling stupid? What are you doing? Sir, we picked up some spies, sir. Wait a moment. There's a possibility they were simply lost in the desert. We'd almost given up. I see. I'll help you, stranger. But in return, you'll have to work off your debt. You'll work in the engine room, the shrimp will take kitchen duty, and the lady comes with me. I'm sorry. Didn't you hear what I said? Move! Get to work! Okay, yeah. <laughs> I'm pretty sure in the original game, at least in the English translation, when they arrived in the ship, they were taken prisoner and then put to work. Not rescued and put to work to pay their debt. Or 
circle. Pirate extraordinaire and scourge of the sea. We're in the desert, bro. Oh, at least I used to be. The ocean's not calm enough these days to make a living pillaging and thundering. But I can't forget the feel of the waves and the salt spray in the air. That's why I stowed away on this ship. I'll a sand ship. I see someday. Mark my words. Someday. You were picked up in the desert too? I wonder what will happen to us. How often does this happen? Admiral Mary of Tasnica is in command. But his grandson Mori calls the shot. If he doesn't like the look of you, you'll end up dumped in a sand dune. This sand ship is the Republic's secret weapon. We're protecting the fire palace from the Empire. Keep it down. Keep it down. Get to work. Get to work doing what? You were picked up in the... You were picked up... You have friends waiting, and you want to escape. Leave it to me. Talk to those guards by the stairs. I'll take care of the rest. Out of my way as we slowly mill about. <laughs> and they didn't notice me get past you. <laughs> Alright, we gotta find Sprite. Looks like you barely had any food in here to begin with. That was the kitchen? <laughs> A little ridiculous, but okay. Alright, there's another ladder out there. Let's see if that goes where we need to go. Not ladder, stairs. It's a Republic secret weapon. Yes, so tell everyone you run across. Okay, I'm gonna have to wander around a little bit to figure out where the hell I'm going. <laughs> when I always wonder how a sand ship is supposed to function. Because I've seen it, the concept. And a number of different stories and games and all that kind of stuff. I mean, it's not like... Oh, oh, it's, there's a door here. <laughs> Alright, I remember now. <laughs> oh, no. it, can't. it can't be. Let's slowly walk there. There's a, there's a staircase over here. Let's see where that goes. Probably, yeah, just up to here. That's a save. Stop this ridiculousness now. But Graham, she disobeyed my... No more pathetic excuses, Maury. You there, get out. Don't have to tell me twice. Am I glad to see you guys? Have you heard this group? They've escaped. Now what do we do, Graham? Escaped? You call this escaping? <laughs> Not a 
soldier. Men, to your battle station. No way! We're with Flory! Let's get out of here! Oh, such brave men. Immediate surrender. <laughs> Yes, surrender, but let us just wander around. Drat! Drat! Surrender. Ooh, it's a different surrender. Surrender! What a coincidence. I didn't think I'd see you here. Have we met? Thanatos' emissary huh. warned me about a group of meddlesome travelers. He must have meant you. Shall we go for a round? Yeah, why the hell not? All right, Mech Rider. <laughs> he's stuck on a rock. Look at that. Oh, nope, he's not stuck on a rock. of an irritating fight both times in the original game because he's all over the damn place. Now of course you could spam him with magic but um, trying not to do that too much. Especially since this game it does seem to be a little bit easier than the SNES version. But uh, I'd not to say I won't occasionally hit him with some magic. Fence down. And he's dead. Oh, and I took a hit anyway. <laughs> Whip orb. What happened to your sand ship? Did it get destroyed? If so, where is the wreckage? All of this bothers me. You fellas are a boot. Look me up if you're injured. Admiral Marier is back to his old self. Yeah, let's get sand ship. Our country is sending a rescue team. Are they? How do you know? Are you no, not yet. I want to talk to these losers. Oh, my beautiful ship. Have you no shame? No shame. If it wasn't for our passengers, we would have been goners. We owe them a debt. What? You know Gemma? But that means you're heroes. I apologize for my grandson's foolish actions. He'll get what's coming to him. You've heard of us, and he didn't bother. Fu ah, never mind. I'd almost forgotten how true soldiers are meant to behave. Thank you for reminding me. Go north from here, and you'll find the Oasis Kingdom known as Katara. West of that. Our country is set. Are you leaving? Go yes, I'm leaving. You'll find the Oasis 